Hi, happy Thursday. Thank you very much for clicking on to a new reading. So I'm going to be using some regular tarot cards, y'all, to write away cards. And these messages are extremely general. I'm just going to ask what it is that you guys could be needing to know right now. Um, the sale reading is still going on. It's $13.33 uh, for, you got three options. You can do the finances and career, a general slash energy read or the love reads. The love reads have been on fire, y'all. And I do want to mention too, I don't do those like messy love reads. Um, I like to promote healing and like glow ups, you know, motivation, encouragement with the love reads. So if you want one of those, definitely um, you can check out the information that's going to be pinned down below in the comment section. So yeah, um, what does the collective need to hear right now? Oh, we got two cards that came out. So this is very interesting. These cards been flying out. It's like when I don't do a read um, for like a whole day, the next time I pick up the cards, the cards be flying out. I guess it'd be like a lot going on. I don't know. <laughs> but the Six of Cups is showing up here, right? And it's King of Pentacles. For some people, you could be familiar with a King of Pentacles, a masculine energy. Um, they could be in this um they could be in this King of Pentacles status, but it looks like you could have a visitor or I see a reconciliation. This could even too be like past life energy, but this is definitely somebody that you are familiar with. So this is the energy that's showing up here right now. So I do see, so we got the past and the future showing up because with the star card coming out. So for some people, um, it looks like there could definitely be a reunion of two souls, right? that have a future. So I feel like there could be definitely something um, in store surrounding a King of Pentacles type of energy. So let's see. Tell me more about this energy. Why does Six of Cups and the King of Pentacles show up for the collective? Why did the King of um, Pentacles and the Six of Cups so we got the Wheel of Fortune card showing up. So yeah, when it comes towards, I feel like divine timing is at work when it comes towards, um, now this could be even too like business, career, finances, but with the Four of Cups coming out here, there's been an unexpected offer that shows up and it's surrounding change. For some people, there could be an unexpected offer that comes in surrounding like, now pay attention to like um, second chances, I don't know why I couldn't get that out, but pay attention to like people wanting second chances. But it is definitely like a familiar spirit, type. not a familiar spirit, like in a negative type of way, but definitely pay attention to that too. But I feel like it's somebody that you have encountered before. It's like you picked up on their vibe, they picked up on your vibe too. So, Oh, and I am seeing too, at one point, now this could be your energy or somebody else's, like you could be this King of Pentacles watching, but at one point in the past, somebody was not so optimistic. They would kind of like close off when it comes towards any type of like offers. It's like maybe they were already, they probably thought they were like satisfied with what they already had. They probably were not open to change because it, it feels like a very stubborn type of energy. Um, Taurus energy could be significant too. What else are they needing to hear? What's this energy about? Oh, you know what this feels like? It's like somebody um, opening up a fortune cookie, right? And it's like, you're not satisfied with the fortune, but it's like, it was actually for you. So being unsatisfied or just like, I don't know, just completely um disconnected when it comes towards like matters of the heart could be significant too oh but you know what i'm seeing too for some people you could be receiving some flowers even like visitations could be significant as well but it's like somebody wants to show you compassion or there was like a share of compassion um, with an encounter between you and another person. It's like they can probably tell that you're compassionate, which is like a rare type of trait. Um, I was about to say, excuse them people walking by, but they on the other side. Okay, what else does the collector need to hear right now? Tell me about the Six of Cups and the King of Pentacles, please. 
Yeah, so the Four of Cups did show up here. We got the full card coming out. So it looks like somebody's ready to take a leap of faith towards a new beginning, a new start. But it seems, I feel like this could be uh, some people's confirmation, but it's almost like in the past, and technically yesterday is the past, but it looks like somebody was not so optimistic. Um, they could have been like very close off when it came towards like new offers or even like a new beginning. It's like being stubborn when it comes towards change. When it's like whole time the divine been showing you signs that it's like, hey, something looks, you know, very stagnant or stuck. So force could be significant too, like 444 or angel numbers. I feel like you could be seeing angel numbers when it comes towards like change or let you know that it's time for change. Let's see. Tell me more about this energy for the collective. Look, we got the high priestess showing up. So definitely trust your intuition, y'all. Trust your intuition and the um, guidance that you could be receiving about this situation. What else are they needing to know right now? What else is the collective need to hear? Look, we got temperance coming out and we got the sun card showing up here too. So it's giving good vibes, y'all. Peace and harmony, balance, being grounded too. So there could be a need to get grounded too, even when it comes to where it's change. So let's see. But I am seeing a reconciliation for some people. Yeah, for some people, you could be seeing signs that something's not growing. It's, it's almost like you could be expecting, um, or maybe you've been waiting for a change or a growth to happen. Um, for some reason, I keep picking up flowers. I'm picking up a lot of flowers. But even too, it's like when you plant a seed, it's like you can't expect it to grow overnight. It's like you got to give it time. So it's like divine timing. Tell me more about this energy here. But yeah, for some people, you could be kind of like doing um, almost like a checklist or looking into certain things in your life. This could be certain connections too. It's like, maybe you're seeing that it's like, there's no type of growth here. It's almost like somebody um, doing like gardening, which I don't have a green thumb at all, but it's like giving that type of energy. Like if you see a plant, it looked like it could be sick or maybe you see that it's not growing. It's like, you could be trying to figure out, um, you know, what to do with it or whatever. I'm not a planter or whatever, but that's the energy is given. It's like somebody checking on their plants. What else are they need to know right now? Look, we got the star card coming out. When it comes towards healing, y'all, especially if you've been definitely doing the healing work, even doing like shadow work too, but it's it's paying off because it, it looks like you're you've been focusing more so on healing for the most part, and it's kind of like you you on divine timing at this point. So there's a need to have faith when it comes towards change, like you seeing change in your life. Let's see. What else are they needing to hear right now? Look, we got the Eight of Wands coming out and we got the Hermit showing up too. So a lot of healing um, is taking place. But it looks like you're coming out of this of hermit mode. But of course, it's like you're looking into certain things. You could be shedding light on certain things too. That's what it looks like as well. Um, let's see what else comes out. What else are they needing to hear right now? What else does the collective need to hear right now? Oh. So we got the Six of Wands showing up. We got the Page of Cups coming out here too. I'm seeing a victory in someone's love life, y'all. There's some good news that's coming in. This could even be like a love letter with the Page of Cups. You could have an admirer too. But I'm going to get some insight on the Six of Cups because it's definitely somebody that you um, have encountered before with the Six of Cups. Tell me about the Six of Cups here. for the collective. Tell me about the Six of Cups for the collective, please. Tell me about the Six of Cups for the collective. 
a feminine water sign you could be a female water sign watching this cancer pisces scorpio look two of cups coming out and we got the nine of cups showing up here at the bottom so it looks like this could definitely be a soulmate connection for some people yeah you could have already met your soulmate but something about like childhood could be significant too or children could be significant it was it's kind of given like two oh that's what it is it's like two kindred spirits um meeting each other for the first time it's like very childlike like very kind let's see tell me about the six of cups here for the collective please tell me about the six of cups for the collective nine of pentacles showing up we got the page of wands coming out Something about gardening could be significant too. But whoever this is, y'all, um, now you could be saying this about a person, but basically it's like, um, somebody was like mesmerized with this nine of pentacles. It's like basically somebody met, like they came encounter with a, a um, listen because this is giving like goddess vibes but you could be a male watching this too but basically it's like a male energy who met like an actual goddess that's what it looked like <laughs> there's like this pinterest um uh, photo that i'll be seeing it's like i'm an actual um goddess or something like that but we got this five of wands coming out i don't know what this energy about it just randomly wanted to pop out what's this about tell me about the six of cups for the collective please yeah, so this two of cups keeps showing up here. And wow, this card really fell down, y'all. It was a two of cups. I can't even grab it right now. I'm gonna have to move my seat, but I can't do that right now. Tell me about the six of cups here for the collective. Tell me about the six of cups here for the collective. So we got the magician card showing up and we got this king of swords coming out too. I feel like this is the same energy, the same person. But it looks like here with the King of Swords could be like a masculine air sign, Aquarius, Gemini, Libra, um, heavy like Gemini energy. But yeah, with the Magician card coming out, somebody's popping back up. And this is one of them situations too, to where it's like the universe fine it's like the universe is so funny how things be happening especially if you reconcile with somebody so you could be seeing signs or synchronicities about you and this person like reuniting. But you know how it's like a funny sign that you may have saw from the, from the universe, y'all. But it could be somebody's like manifesting you. That's what it looks like. It looks like a um, possibly a king of pentacles could be manifesting you or manifesting like a another encounter with a, a actual goddess. That's what it looks like. But yeah, that's what's showing up here, y'all. So I don't know. They could be um, using like, you know, law of attraction, law of assumption. They manifesting though. That's what it looked like. So I'm going to end the read here, you guys. But thank you very, very much for watching.